other over the conduct of two housemates who've been expelled. Some politicians share his anger, but others are concerned at the potential loss of jobs and local production. The network has branded much of the concern an overreaction. Inside the Big Brother house, it's far from business as usual, as the housemates come to terms with an incident which has turned their world upside down. What Michael Ashley Cox and Michael John Brick did for Adair was in direct breach of the Big Brother rules. I said to Big Brother, there was no malice intended. Yeah. They were doing it in a playful way. While she won't lay charges, the incident has led to calls for all the housemates to be evicted. Here's a great opportunity for Channel 10 to do a bit of self-regulation and get this stupid program off the air. Some MPs are demanding immediate intervention. How many more incidences like this are we going to have to put up with before the show's pulled? The adults only version was axed a fortnight ago, but Big Brother itself is here to stay. These guys broke the house rules and were removed from the house. That's the way the show operates and that's the way we guaranteed to the government that the show would operate. The incident didn't go to air on Channel 10, but it was seen on the web early on Saturday morning. The broadcasting watchdog is preparing a report for the government, which has the option of calling an inquiry. Others are on Big Brother's side. The show now big business in the Sunshine State. But do I want to see another program here? Yes, I do. Should they clean up their act? Yes, they should. But it shouldn't mean that the show's scrapped. Finn Kemp, 10 News.